So this is my makeup vanity for the time being. This is where I record all of my makeup videos. Sometimes I do it from my window, but most of the time I do it from here. And it is as organized as I'm gonna get it for the time being. But a lot of you guys have been requesting an updated makeup collection because I haven't done a makeup collection since 2010. So it's a little ridiculous that, uh, yeah, I haven't done one in two years, but I'm rambling and Hey, Chuckly Chew! Look at Chuckles over there moving. <laughs> He's like, who am I talking to? He's like, I'm sleepy. Time to go to bed. But anyways, so we're going to go ahead, get into the whole vanity thing. And I'm just going to skim through everything because it's going to take forever if I don't. Okay? Okay, the first side of my vanity, I've got... This is where I keep anything that I'm having like a contest for. So in here is my BH Party Girl palette because I'm having a contest with that on my website. So yeah, that's in there. Um, I've been trying out the Sedona Lace Midnight Lace brush set. Right here I've got some makeup books. I've got a Bobbi Brown makeup manual. I've got my Kevin Aquan making faces on the bottom. I've got some magazines, some catalogs, and in here is where I write all you guys' requests. So I keep this on my vanity. Here is where I keep all my palettes. Like this is the 120 eyeshadow palette from BH Cosmetics. I have another 120 palette here. I've got the 88 original palette. I've got, this is the 88 Metals Mania palette from Sedona Lace. This is the 168 Sedona Lace palette. I've got the 88 Warm palette from Coastal Scents. The 88 Colors Tropical Shimmer palette from BH Cosmetics. Uh, the 28 Neutral palette from Coastal Scents. And then the 88 Cool Matte palette from BH Cosmetics. And all of this stuff has dust on it. That's sad, right? Here is where I keep my facial brushes, the ones that I'm not currently using. I just keep them up here, and they're an assortment of MAC, BH Cosmetics, Sedona Lace, Sigma, Ulta, NARS, Coastal Scents. Yeah, all that good stuff. Okay, here is my makeup mirror. And I purchased this from Target. I've got my Sonia Kushik blending sponge. I have all my kabukis right here. I've got some NYX Jumbo pencils in here. Right here I keep my lip pencils. I've got MAC, NYX, um, Milani, Wet n Wild, Prestige. A lot of different brands in there. I've got my Yes to Cucumber makeup wipes here. I need to get some more. And we're going to zoom in on this other stuff. So over in this area is where I keep all my facial products that I use on an everyday basis. We've got some Lush products. We've got Eve Pearl. My Witch Hazel is back there. Um, L'Oreal waterproof eye makeup remover. I've got my Telica Liposils, which is just like the eyelash primer thing that you use to extend your lashes. Sorry about that, y'all. Um, <laughs> I've got some eye stuff over here, which you can't see because these brushes are in the way. I got my contact lenses, all that good stuff in there. I'm not going to go through all this because it's going to take forever. Okay, and here is the makeup that I use on an everyday basis. So... In this area, I keep all my eyebrow stuff. In this area, lip stuff, face stuff, and eye stuff is over here. So foundation, um, like bronzer, concealers. I have some blotting paper back there. Then I've got my mascaras and eyeliners and lashes and eyeshadow primer up in that region. Back there are my eye brushes and anything that's not like for your face pretty much and I've got my used brushes my brushes that I use every day in here and these are brushes that I use regularly but they're clean I keep my dirty and clean brushes in different places here I have my makeup setting sprays Urban Decay 
Do Me All Nighter. Um, this is model in a bottle. I absolutely love this. And then I've got my Evian just water facial spray just for refreshing my makeup. Okay, we're at the end of the table finally. And in here is where I keep all my cotton balls and I'm running out so I need to get some more. Back here I have all my facial primers. Ooh, I'm dropping stuff. I've got Tarte, L'Oreal, oh my goodness. I've got Napoleon Perdice, Michael Todd. I mean, I've got a bunch of stuff in here. So I'm not gonna go through it all, but yeah. That's all facial primers in there. And then in here I keep eye creams. And then back here are some of my lashes, my most used lashes. I've got some from my beauty supply store. I've got Ardell, um, Ardell, Salon Perfect, Glam Eye. I've got Red Cherries. So I've got an assortment of lashes in there. Okay, now we're getting to the first part of my makeup drawer vanity. So right here I've got all my eyeshadows. Let me get closer so you guys can see. And these are my loose eyeshadows. I should mention that, right? So really quickly here, I've got my Raving Beauty Cosmetic Pigments. I've got Glamamore. I've got, and the Glamamore is over here. I've got Jessie's Girl. I forget where these two stacks are from. I've got Cargo and Clinique. These are, what are these? Face Front Cosmetics, love these. Hot Luxor back here and up here as well. We've got Sugar Pill, my favorite here, the loose pigments. We've got the Sugar Pill actual press pigments. I've got All May, Ulta, some L'Oreal, drugstore stuff over here, Maybelline CoverGirl, and then Elf back there. I've got some NYX Pearl Pigments. I've got some MAC Pigments right up here. I've got NYX Single Eyeshadows. I've got Wet n Wild right here. You can't see them, but they're down there. Um, I've got a Solo NARS Pigment. I need to get more. Well, not pigment, but eyeshadow. Hip. MAC. Most of my MAC is in palettes, but this one is not. I've got Ulta. So yeah, let's move on to the next drawer. So drawer number two is my eyeshadow palettes, the ones that didn't fit up there. So we've got some sugar pill back here. This is, ooh, I'm dropping stuff. This is the, I can't remember, it doesn't say the name. And this is their new one. I haven't used the new one. I've got the Naked palette back here, as well as the 48 Double Stack palette. That didn't fit up there. And then, what's that? That's the 20 Matte and Shimmer palette. I've got a BH 15 Color palette. Kate Von D palette. Nude Tude from the Balm is back there. BH Party Girl Palette, Too Faced Eyeshadow Insurance Policy Palette. I've got a MAC Neutral and Color Eyeshadow Palette here. We've got the Shady Lady by The Bomb. This is Volume 3. Over here I've got a Michael Todd. And then we've got just a whole bunch of Wet n Wild over in that corner. So this third drawer are blushes. And I used to not like blushes, but I've recently got into blushes like crazy. So yeah, my blush collection is growing slowly, but steadily, if that makes any sense. No, that doesn't make sense, but whatever. So we've got some NARS blushes over here. I mainly keep my NARS blushes in my kit, but these are my NARS brushes. Blushes. I've got... Glamamore blushes. These are really pigment. Love these. This is uh, Fox in a Box by Hard Candy. Back here, I've got uh, MAC blushes and this palette. This is a uni palette. I've got MAC blushes in here as well as that palette back there. I'm not going to open that because it's going to take too long. 
We've got Milani Mineral Blushes here, Milani Baked Blushes here, Tarte all in there. These are the Balm Blushes. We've got some bronzers. These are all like, all my liquid stuff is right here. I don't have too many like cream liquid stuff. So matte cream blush, I got these Dream Bouncy blushes. Um, I've got a, what is this? This is a Michael Todd blush. This is a Black Radiance blush that I actually um, crushed and I just put it in here. This is a gorgeous color. This one is Plum Sorbet. I just had to show you guys because it's absolutely a gorgeous color. And then I've got a CoverGirl blush back there. I've got a Giselle bronzer, face front bronzer, true match. I've got some drugstore stuff back here as well as a CoverGirl bronzer. I lied. There's more cream products. These Urban Decay, um, what are these? They're cream highlights. I've got three of these back here. And then I've got a blush palette here. Ooh, if y'all can see that. I can't pull the drawer out even any further, but there's blushes in there. And then I've got some Milani like highlighters and bronzers, and then Revlon Color Stay little mineral pressed powders, Wet n Wild, and then my Balm Mary Luminizer and Betty Luminizer. I love these. This is the bronzer, this is the highlighter. Okay, we're on the fourth drawer down. These are my foundations, concealers, powders. This is probably my favorite drawer, and let me push that back. Okay, really quickly, I've got my MAC foundations, face and body, Matchmaster, Pro Longwear, Makeup Forever HD, Prescriptives, I've got Revlon, Maybelline here, Color Stay, Revlon Color Stay, and then my Coastal Scents um, Undercover HD Foundations. I love these. I use all these shades. I use some for contouring, some for highlighting, and some are just, you know, my color. And then here I've got Fashion Fair souffle makeup as well as the stick foundations this is my mon second to none stick foundation this is maybelline fit me these two are l'oreal true match maybelline dream matte mousse and i've got some samples back here right here is my eve pearl press powder love this it's just back there in the back as well as my Bare Minerals Original Foundation. I've got Sephora Mattifying Foundation back there. My MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Deep Dark. Uh, Cover Girl Translucent Powder and Translucent Honey. I've got two Black Opal Deluxe Finishing Powders. And over here is my Sedona Lace Camouflage Concealer Palette. That's what's back there. I've got my MAC um, Just Custom Concealer Palette. This is my Coastal Scents. Um, Camo Quad and Dark, Ben Nye, SK3 Well. If you've been following me a while, you remember this. Sheer Cover Concealer. We've got two Bobbi Browns, Matte Concealer. This is the Coastal Sense Bright Eye Concealer in Dark. I've got some CoverGirl Queen and Black Radiance Elf Complete Coverage Concealer. And yeah, let's move on to the next drawer.